Hello everybody and a very warm welcome back to the channel. Well, what an eventful 24 hours we've had with Microsoft and Asobo announcing out of the blue that Microsoft Flight Simulator 2024 will be set to be released next year. Now this sent all the forums and Discord servers into absolute meltdown as no real information was actually given following the announcement and of course took everybody by complete surprise. This even included developers and left us with far more questions rather than answers. Now it seems that the development managers have actually come out and tried to air and address all those important and pressing questions that the whole community wanted to simply know. Why they couldn't do that before they actually dropped the bombshell, God only knows. But it got us all certainly talking and maybe that was their plan all along. But for us, the community, We've invested so much time and money into Microsoft Flight Simulator with all the add-ons and all we simply wanted to know was what will happen to Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020 after 2024 gets released. So the managers have taken to all the forums and have confirmed that Microsoft Flight Simulator 2024 is a completely new simulator and have apologised for the delay in communication following the trailer release and have answered a few questions that we all have. The main question is, will all my purchases from the third party developers, marketplace and all the aircrafts be supported within the new simulator? And the good news is yes. The add-ons will still be supported, which is great, especially for those who have invested so much already, which means aircraft, airports will all be transferable into the new simulator. However, they have also said that in very few exceptions, virtually all add-ons that work in Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020 today will function in Microsoft Flight Simulator 2024. And with purchases in the marketplace, will not need it to be repurchased. So I think this is all what we wanted to know in the first place. I would love to know what you think, so please leave a comment below with regards to what we've heard from the developers about your add-ons working straight away in Microsoft Flight Simulator 2024 and will you be purchasing it? Now let's address the other elephant in the room. Now Microsoft and Sobo claimed when Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020 was released that both of them was in it for the long haul and dedicated to the development for the next 10 years. So what's going to happen when the new simulator is released next year? A Sobo have come out and said that they will continue the development and the current Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020 roadmap, which include sim updates, avionic updates, city and world updates. And Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020 players will also get the free June downloadable content. So the good news is they're still going to develop Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020 after the release of 2024. I know a load of you, me included, are a bit cynical. How can they continue to update both when they can't seem to get Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020 right straight out of the box with all its bugs and glitches? However, I think Microsoft and Asobo are leaning more to the gaming market. And hey, who can blame them if that's where the money is? But for those who have stayed loyal and simply like flying an aircraft from point A to B, would be a real shame to lose them. However, I don't think that will actually happen as there seems to be a career mode within Microsoft Flight Simulator 2024. I'd just like to say a massive thank you for watching and I hope you found this video useful. Don't forget to leave a like and if you are new to the channel, please don't forget to subscribe and click on the notification bell for any future content or live streams. Until the next video, take care. Bye bye for now.